And I was 17 years old, a senior in high school, and I woke up one morning and couldn't stand up straight. Uh, sitting was very painful for me, so going to class and sitting for a couple hours, I'd have to go home and lie down. And, you know, especially by the end of the day, it was the worst at night because you've gone through all your day events. And I was um, kind of thinking that I wasn't going to be able to do a lot and that my back would affect my career choices, which is tough being at this stage in my life and trying to figure out what I do want to do, but then throwing in the fact that can I do, you know, once I figure out this is what I want to do with my life, can I do it because of my back pain? I tried numerous treatments, including physical therapy, went to see a chiropractor, I did acupuncture, um, spinal injections, uh, drug therapy. Uh, nothing was really working for me though. It was a lot of, I guess, lonely times. <laughs> Um, I had pain along my lower back and down the back of both of my legs. She was very active. She was a soccer player. She played lots of different sports. And at an early age, she started having severe pain. And I began to talk to her about the percutaneous discectomy procedure, um, describe to her the risks and benefits, talk to her about the possibility of this procedure taking away her pain without having an open surgery. Um, and I really thought it was the best option for her. And she had all these things going for her. She had every opportunity to become a dentist, but her pain was holding her back. And so the percutaneous discectomy allows us, with a short 30-minute procedure, decompress the disc, take material out with a small needle. It, the procedure is done with x-ray guidance, and most patients are able to go home within a couple hours. It was the first procedure that automatically on the table, I felt relief. Just being able to know I can go out and do things without hesitation. I'm a psychology major, however, I just applied to dental school, which is absolutely thrilling to me. 